Москва немного выигрывает он пространство. И первый лоу-кик. Ну, неплохо поджимает Иван Богданов. Интересно, когда он начнет все-таки выбрасывать удары. Да, пытается его поймать на левой боковой, на, на сближении. Гонсалвес, а вот теперь уже О. делает то же самое едва ли. Да, ой ой, -ой. Все в голову летит. И -и -и -и. Ничего себе! Вы это видели? Момент АСИ 179. Ну что ж, мы так долго-долго шли к этому через длинные, затяжные, наполненные драматургией поединки, а теперь вот такая драма. И получите, и распишитесь. Возможно, это самый быстрый поединок на сегодняшнем турнире, но какой же он яркий! Trying, it takes so much energy for him to just go, nice elbows. And now we're halfway through the fight. Oh, got another elbow in. Ooh, Wong. Lil Wobbly trying to move from left to right. Oh, and then Elbow a knee. From Saragossa. Oh, oh, oh wow. Oh, Vicious my goodness. Knockout. Take a look at this. All right, so they're standing. Oh, it was just a jab that got him oh. right on the button. Ooh, hoo, hoo. boom, out. Oh my goodness! And you were talking how with the welterweights, you know, each punch matters so much. Oh wow! Scanlon seems like the type of fighter when he gets hit, he just goes for it again. Well, he's certainly shown some heart. He got dropped early, Absolutely. and he, he he's coming back. And he, he just looks to be slightly more technical with the way he puts his punches together. But the power and the size certainly belongs on Mata Ali's side. And a, a little breather from both boys as they uh, gather their wits about them. I don't blame them, I've got to be honest, but you're right. Mata Ali is using that size advantage and he goes in and hits Dominic Scanlon well. Certainly carried the heavier amble. Here, here we go. There was that elbow, but the left hook lands on Mata Ali right about here. We'll see it in a minute. Boom. And then there's left straight, right on the temple of... ...underway quickly here. And Nick's got to be careful not to, to stay in the... Oh my God! What, what a knockout! Have you ever seen anything oh like that? Oh my God! God. Switch kick, unconscious! What the heck? Oh, oh my God! My God! The execution... Oh dude, it was... And we said whatever he throws, it's so much force, and then the the, the well, rotation he had on it got, is scary. Oh, oh, it was all shin, all to the jaw and neck. Oh. I mean, he was unconscious instantly. Have you ever seen a oh, jumping yeah, switch yeah, kick yeah, land yeah. as well as that on someone seven inches tall? Dance, eh? <laughs> давление там у Рахмана. Двойка, чисто в голову от Тимирова. Тупан корпуса меняет этажи атак. Еще одна серия в голову Тимиров. Молодец, наращивает обороты. Чего себе, какой путь выбирает Абдул Рахман Тимиров с чугунноголовым Диасом. Начинает зарубаться. О, о, поплыл, кажется, Диас. И еще один удар. Максим Бродосов уже готов остановить эту встречу. Пропускай слишком много. Все. Все. Абдул Рахман Тимиров. Рот. Смотрим еще раз. Буквально за считанные секунды Кокран принял просто колоссальное количество ударов в голову. Well. No It was a barrage of punches up. Here we go once again. Lead him with that left kick, then a flurry of winding shots. But this was the combination that did the job and shot selection. Boom. Tim Kelts is going to have to get down and go for a shoot pretty quick to go downstairs to level up things against a giant in Dylan Ryich. You can already see the difference in cage craft here from Ryich, and he's new to the cage, right? He's come from the squared circle, always hurt well. Yeah, left, right, that left hand's going in, doesn't even have to go down too hard for the ground and bound. Tries to finish his man on the wire, that's it, it's all over in the first round! Making his debut here tonight, 
Dylan Ryan! Given a couple of opportunities here. You see the punishment. Despite the coverage, this guy has serious power, Will. Referee Sintich made the right decision here. That was just punishment on a stick. Early a little tickler to the middle stump. Ducked under that one and then went with the round left hook as well. There's a big right hand and I think that might have wob wobbled Lawrence Louis there, although he's come back well. Good solid fight from both these boys. Good leg work there from Chow, mixing the high and low. Technical bout. The corner's very vocal there, as well as they try right Straining elbows! Huge right! Lawrence Liu was just a little tighter with it. Let's see if the cameraman caught it. Just working towards it. And there it is right there. It was, he oh. had the collar tie. He this is a, a fantastic MMA bout. Man, the matchmaker put a good fight together. Leo really, <laughs> Leo really understands distance. You see, effortless. Oh, oh my man. God! Oh my God! Head kick! This is over. Oh my God! Darrell Look at Darrell's eyes! Look at his he eyes! Stopped. He should probably stop this. Oh my God! What a great fight! Wow! Yeah. His eyes! Look at his he eyes! He should probably stop this. Oh my God! What a great fight! Wow! Talking about weathering the storm. Look, these gloves don't allow. Oh, and there's a the big left hook. Huge left hook because he digged in with the body with the right hand and he got countered with the left hook. Not a good punching option right there. And he looks very much at sea. Victorian Anson just checking if he can continue. He says yes. But you have to, to go. think that Keegan Transu is going to look for the finish here very early. Now working his gloves again. And Victorian Anson steps it's in and has called this. To the MMA rounds and he got on board early. Of course, when you're starting in, they, they get through spots, they get to the body, and there is not a lot of forgiveness on there. It's not even like the 10 ounce gloves. The, the big man Jackson, man. Six foot four. So what Robert needs to do is push the hips away of Jackson and try and get his legs out of this position. He can't oh, just like arm fight oh, with wow. him here. He's gonna oh, get. he got to bring his knees in. But he can't continue to take this punishment. He's knocked out if he does not improve this position. He, oh. Wow. I'm, uh, uh, oh, my God. If he does not improve this position. He, oh. Wow. I'm, uh, uh, oh, my God. Есть возможность, опять же, для нанесения ударов колено в бедро. Есть возможность для попытки перевода, стаскивания соперника в партер. Можно попробовать выстрелить, просто там, расцепить захват и выстрелить с руки в голову. А вот здесь у Маргинковский, опять же, может действовать как Джон Джонс, да, ударить локтем со спины. Так, и что сейчас произошло? Это гримаса была на лице Умара. И серия из ударов. От Шарафа до Владмуродова все. Выбегает сразу же радостный Тарас Кияшко, тренер Шарафа до Владмуродова. Поздравляет его очень жестко. Вот опять же, Вадим, да, о чем мы с вами и говорили, что здесь была возможность наносить более амплитудные, более жесткие удары с колена. И одно из них зашло так, что у Марин... Nice <laughs> he held on to that. Another good kick to the body. And oh, he shot him with him. that one. That was perfectly placed.